why in the world would a light lyric soprano choose to sing Schumann's Dichterliebe? Well, after having learned about 400 songs in my repertoire, I thought it was time that I embarked upon new repertoire, repertoire that isn't necessarily expected of me. So I chose one of my favorite composers, Schumann, and the poems that, and the music that men always get to sing. Um, and I must say, it's a new experience for me, and I think it gives another dimension to this song cycle, which one only ever hears from men. Schumann is always very well written for the piano because he was a very good pianist. Um, and I love trying to create the colours that he wanted. Um, I often, uh, when I play the piano, uh, in, particularly in Schumann, try and orchestrate the sound in my mind, make all the different colours of different instruments. And I think he obviously had that sort of imagination. Um, there are some technical difficulties, of course, but uh, it's nice to have a challenge. It isn't really sung by women, too. I'm one of the first ones. Of, of course, Lotte Lehmann sang these songs before, way back when. Jenny Lind sang the songs at Dichteliebe back in 1840, um, 1850, actually. Um, and uh, uh, Birgitta Fassbender recorded these songs as well. Of course, she has a much heavier voice, a mezzo voice and perhaps can do some of the heavier songs more convincingly. But nonetheless, it's not only about uh, trying to emulate a man, it's about passion. It's about love in its pure sense without gender. Love doesn't belong to men. Love doesn't belong only to women. It belongs to all of us, and it doesn't matter who we're singing about. It just, it's just the passion and the emotion that counts. Um, the fact that the poems are about love means that it does represent the year of his marriage, but uh, they're not as happy as I hope he was in the year of his marriage. He wrote three cycles. He wrote Frau Niebundleben, Liederkreis and Dichterliebe in the year of his marriage. Um, it just shows that his mind was alive with ideas, new ideas, new sentiments. Um, the poems, the Heiner poems of Dichterliebe, are all of a certain type. They start very positive and then there's usually a twist in the tale at the end of the poem and the piano postlude often represents this twist. Uh, there's one, Und wissen die Blumen die Kleinen, where she looks at nature and thinks it's wonderful. Um, but then, at the end, she says, only one person knows my pain. And then the piano part goes into this wonderful sort of tirade at the end, uh, which is completely different and totally unexpected. Almost a lot of the songs do that. Interestingly, I've taken uh, some of the songs in the baritone key and some of the songs in the tenor key because although it says high voice, tenor is very different than soprano. It has a, a different point where, the, where the, the voice has the break. So some of the songs work better for my particular voice in a lower key, strangely. Again, it doesn't matter what gender one uses. Should I change the songs and say it's about him instead of about her? It doesn't matter. That's the whole point, is that this music and this poetry, poetry transcends being a gender. It, it has nothing to do with the sex of the person singing or the sex of the person to whom you're singing. It's simply it's the, the raw emotion and, and what makes life important, which is love. I love uh, the teamwork, the two, two of you working together and the fact that you make something new every single time that you are out on that stage. I mean, I must have played Dichterliebe 60, 70 more, um, but every single time I play it, even with the same singer, it's different. Uh, you react off each other like you react off a friend or have a conversation with a friend. It is a bit like having a really good conversation. You work out basically what you're going to do, and then you leave all the doors open for something different to happen in a concert, because the, uh, the audience, the, the atmosphere in the audience, the atmosphere in the hall, all makes uh, a difference to the way you play. And that's what I like about it. It's something new every time.
Tage die Sonne, die liebt dich einst alle in Liebeswohn. Ich lieb sie nicht mehr, ich liebe alleine die Kleine, die Feine, die Reine, die Eine. Sie selber alle Liebe wohn, ist Ruse und Lehe und Taube und Sonne. Ich liebe alleine die Kleine, die Feine, die Reine, die Thank you.
das Mädchen nimmt aus Ärger den ersten besten Mann, der hier in den Weg gelaufen, der Jüngling ist übel dran. Es ist eine alte Geschichte, doch bleibt sie immer neu. Und wem sie just passiert, dem bricht das Herz in zwei.
Jetzt begraben. 